Most people outside the AV Geek community, and the frequent flyers who are exacting about what they want in a flight, even if they're not plane spotters, don't pay much attention to aircraft types. That's a mistake, because the type of aircraft operating your flight can have a huge impact on the overall flight experience, especially if you're flying economy, where every advantage helps. Knowing what to look for as you search for flights to book takes quite a depth of knowledge and interest, and most people don't have time for that. It is possible, though, to give some general guidelines for planes you should keep an eye out for the next time you're shopping for flights. These are the top 5 to aim for if you want a better flight. Five Airbus A320neo The A320neo looks about the same as older A320 family planes, but you can tell it apart by its much bigger engines and distinctive winglets. As an older aircraft with some design improvements, it doesn't change the game for passengers like the A350 does, but you're much more likely to come across an A320-sized plane, and if you do, see if you have the option of a NEO, look out for code 32N or A20N. The big plus is a much quieter flight, plus likely a more modern cabin with nice lighting. It's also fuel-efficient and puts out less emissions. Downsides, it's still a 3-3 configured plane in economy, which means that those who like a window seat have to be sandwiched in by up to two strangers. Some airlines that have it, Delta, American, Frontier, Spirit, Interjet, SAS, British Airways, Lufthansa, TAP, Turkish Airlines. Coming soon, with over 6,000 on order, there are many on the way across the world. 4. Airbus A380 The A380 may soon be a thing of the past after Airbus announced this year that due to slow sales it would be halting production in the next couple of years. But the double-decker behemoth remains a fantastic airplane to fly on, even if it's a little too big for more airlines to make money with. It's quiet and smooth, handles turbulence better than just about anything out there, and evokes a romantic, cruise ship in the sky feeling. Downsides, it has relatively small windows, its lower deck is almost overly cavernous, and boarding and deplaning alongside so many people at once can be a slow process. But still, it's a very comfortable airplane. 5. Some airlines that have it, British Airways, Lufthansa, Air France, All Nippon Airways, Etihad, Emirates, Qatar Airways, Singapore Airlines, Thai Airways, Qantas. Coming soon, unfortunately there are unlikely to be any new airlines operating the type, and some of the above airlines may soon start to phase them out. 3. Boeing 767 This might be a surprise because the Boeing 767 is an older plane. But it's still a transatlantic workhorse, turns out it ranks number 3 across the pond, and there's one simple reason to choose it, a 2-3-2 configuration in economy. That means only one middle seat for every row, and for those traveling in pairs it's a nice option for sitting together and having a window without a stranger sharing your set of seats. And although it's an old aircraft at this point, most of the Boeing 767s still flying have the Nice Boeing 777-style overhead bins and reasonably comfortable interiors anyway. If it's between a Boeing 767 and a Boeing 787, with its narrow 333 configuration, I'll pick a Boeing 767 every time. Some airlines that have it, United, Delta, American, LATAM, Austrian Airlines, All Nippon Airways, Japan Airlines. Coming soon, none, but there are rumors that Boeing may launch a new engine variant and extend its life further. We'll see what happens. 2. Airbus A220 the A220's benefits are covered here at length, but to rehash briefly, it's a fantastically roomy plane considering it's relatively small, seat count just over 100, it's quiet, and it has all the newest tech like nice lighting and more. 
Together, the A220 family represents the most efficient aircraft in the skies in their class, with low operating costs and the lowest noise levels of any commercial jet in production. This makes the A220 family aircraft ideal for urban operations and noise-sensitive airports. These aircraft expand the Airbus single-aisle family to cover the 100-150 seat segment, and respond to a worldwide market demand for smaller single-aisle jetliners. Some airlines that have it, Delta, Air Baltic, Swiss, Korean Air, Air Tanzania. Coming soon, Air Canada, Air France, and more. 1. Airbus A350 the A350 has entered a number of airlines' fleets over the past few years and it is quick becoming a passenger favorite. This fuel-efficient twin-engined, long-haul plane is unbelievably quiet, though it still feels powerful, and boasts a lower cabin altitude, higher humidity, taller ceilings and bigger windows. It's a good bet, it will also have all the modern airplane perks like mood lighting and the latest entertainment systems and Wi-Fi, oh and then there's the stunning tail camera. Seats in economy are usually laid out in a 3-3-3 configuration, the same as most Boeing 787s, but the A350 cabin is wider, so everyone gets more room to stretch out. Some airlines that have it, Qatar Airways, Delta, Finnair, Japan Airlines, Lufthansa Cathay Pacific, Singapore Airlines. Coming soon, Scandinavian Airlines gets their first A350 this December. And there you have it. I hope it helps. For more of this kinds of videos, please hit like, comment and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel, IF Videos. Thanks for watching.